So today I wanted to show you this app called iTabla Pro. It's an app that a lot of Indian classical musicians and Kirtan singers use. It has two tanpuras that you can tune to a key that you want to sing or play in. It also has a lot of different tabla samples in it. So let's maybe take a look. Uh, this is what the home screen looks like. It has the main key written right there and it has an up arrow key, a down arrow key so that you could adjust it. So for example, if you were to sing something in another key, you can just do that. It goes down or you can do this and it comes up. So typically, actually a lot of female singers prefer to use A sharp 3 as their key and a lot of male singers use C or even D as their key and these are you know very very broad guidelines uh, you feel free to adjust it to whatever you were song is in then under that you would see two main menus right one is called volume one is called pan and the panning is just that if you attach it to a stereo output then you can pan it to the right speaker of the or the left speaker i just tend to keep everything right in between so that everything plays equally on both the speakers uh, then we when we are in this volume you will see that we have a master we have tanpura one tanpura two Surpeti, we have Tabla, we have Manjira and we have Swaramandal. We will take a look at each one of these options. Underneath this here at the bottom you have Mixer, you have Controls, Presets, Swaramandal and more. So for basic just Tanpura thing, all that you need to do is suppose I do that. It will start playing and as you can see I have actually connected this to an external amplifier and I always feel like the sound especially that of tabla is much 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 better with an external speaker so this is Tanpura one Tanpuras are big string instruments with four strings they are tuned to sa which is the root note the fifth and so here you can change these settings as well so that is Tanpura 1 this is Tanpura 2 so then there are like two Tanpuras playing yeah uh, typically in a concert setting there are two Tanpuras that play together I'm going to switch that off so to switch that off you just need to you know click on it one more time then let me click this off then there is this thing called a surpeti it's a more continuous sound like that yeah then there is of course tabla we will look at tabla in detail but it will just from from this page it will just be on or off you can do more controls and settings from this controls tab there is also this manjira which will basically only play if the tabla is on so it is disabled by default then there is swaramandal swaramandal yeah so it will play according to what rag you have in this preset basically plays the entire scale once you can choose different ragas so if you know the raga that your song is in you can go to preset here you will see all the ragas that are there you can even like pick a few favorites like i have right i sing a lot in this rag by the way so that is that preset if I switch all of this off just so that you can just listen to the swaram until it yeah that will play like that okay so now let's go to controls here is actually where you will make most of your settings so here on top is the name of the tal right now it says metronome because that is what I have picked 
if you click on that drop down you get all these thals so typically a lot of kirtans are actually in this tal called bhajani eight beats and there are different styles there is a pro default which i really like there is a shuffle style which just shuffles through the various variations there is a variation one variation two variation three four five a lot of variations you can actually pick from here and then there is also a basic which doesn't basically add any fills to it i like the pro default style uh, once you have picked your tal the main tal you have picked the style you can actually control the speed here so right here where it says 110 bpm that is the speed that you have picked if i want to make this faster uh, i can always do plus five and it will add in fives right i can subtract in fives as well if i want to make it like drastically faster i can do 2x which will just make it like 220 from 110 it went to 220 if i want to reduce i can divide it by 2 and get back to 110 yeah and this plus and minus will increase or decrease it by 1 so 110 will become 111 yeah okay back to 110 this little symbol is for that manjira this will only play if the tabla is on so let's maybe just listen okay so that's what the tabla sounds like if i want to increase the volume let's say of this tabla i need to go to the mixer and i see that the tabla is already maxed out here so i can actually increase this master so that it becomes a bit louder okay so tabla i can either switch it off here and it will switch off or i can switch it off from here like that yeah i can also control my master which basically includes the tanpura swaramandal everything from right here yeah everything is on now if i on the switch on the master so let's also let's see so manjira is on zero here right so if i do that then you can hear that manjira sound okay so that is your tabla let me switch it off for just a minute I'm going to switch off this manjira thing here you can sort all your thals there are a lot of thals most of them you might even not use the one that I really use is for classical Indian music this teen tal which is a 16 beat tal here it conveniently shows you right the number of beat that it is in 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 yeah uh, so maybe you know like just have a few favorites so for for me it is always this teen tal uh, i also play a lot in ek tal which is a 12 beat one i play in chap tal which is a 10 beat and then of course i play in this bhajani and also sometimes some kirtans actually in keherwa this rupak is a very very nice tal to play with as well it's a seven beat odd cycle tal so but this is where you will choose your tal and this is where you will choose your style uh, so what else so tanpura right here you see the, the settings that you can make to your tanpura so by default tanpuras are tuned to per however there are some rags that omit per that do not have that fifth note so that those for those rags you might need to want to have it on ma instead of per yeah 
A lot of times people also tune one tanpura to pa and the other one to me if both those notes are in the rag. You could do that or you could have actually both at pa. You could also do some more like tunings here, right? You can pick a note from that. You can maybe, you know, you want sa as your note. Yeah? You could do that here. I would go back to pa, you know, it's the typical tuning. So here is where you will choose that. Now this is getting too loud so let me turn the volume. So remember that mixer is a place where you will control the volume of individual things. Control is the panel where you will you know pick what you want. There are of course presets that come with all of this you can use them but what i have noticed is that whenever i click on a preset it just makes everything too loud as well it changes all of your volume settings so for example if i want to sing in this rap yeah see it will like kind of you know make everything loud I like to keep it like that and have tabla a little higher. That works for me and I somehow, I always have this surpeti off because it gives a very sharp tone. Most of the time I also have my swaramandal off. What I do is I just switch it on during the very beginning of a performance. Okay, so that is that. Now, there is more here, right? So, let's click on that more. More has lot of settings. You can use this as a tuner to tune any other string instrument. If you go here to the settings, there are different settings for the Tanpura Tabla that you can make. You can change the tempo of Tanpura. It is right now by default at 128 beats per minute. I would recommend that you do not change it. You can change the tuning if you are playing and or performing something at 432 hertz instead of the standard 440. You can do that. You can also go to 442 hertz and everything will change accordingly. I like to keep my Tanpura at dual octave because you know that way it goes higher, it works well with my voice. Enable Ati Komal. These will come into play when you are playing certain rags that have Shrutis instead of Swar and they use a pretty you know like particular or a certain ati komal basically means something that is lower than a flat note it doesn't appear on our keyboard instruments so those are settings for tanpura i would say don't play around too much with it maybe if you have to make changes maybe only change this tuning here then we come to tabla tabla so you can change the sort order i like to have have it by the number of matras basically meaning number of beats alphabetical will just change it and make it alphabetical so let's make it alphabetical for a second if i go here now right it's all over the place because now it's alphabetical and Yeah, I like it to be with the number of matras. Show tal bowls. This is really useful. So if I turn this on and if I play, so now here you can see, right? It's saying the bowls. Da, din, din, ta, ta, din. This is really useful if you are looking to 
learn these tals uh enable sur tabla you sur tabla this will make the sound of the tabla a bit different yeah do you hear the difference it gives it a more pakhawaj kind of a sound i like to keep that off then there are some miscellaneous settings enable concert mode i always have it at on allow external audio i have that at on so that you know i can actually connect it to my amplifier background play i keep it on so that it is on even if my video is on or something else is on so that is here you can yeah we missed this right so if i make this sharper it will become bit sharper yeah it will actually also show you the frequency for just a second so it changed yeah plus 2 the this setting is really useful if you want to uh, if you are tuning with an instrument that cannot be tuned uh, let's say you have a harmonium that is a bit high pitched than uh, the perfect 440 hertz tuning then maybe you can change your tanpura settings here just a bit to adjust for that but by default like keep it keep it all green green is good okay so that is that i mean typically i just like to have like one tanpura on and this tabla on and then you can sing that is pretty much what is there to it yeah you can play around with the presets if you want to it is nice panning is good if you have dual uh, speakers uh, but that is pretty much it uh this interface on ipad looks a bit different let's maybe also take a look at that so here is my ipad so here is what it looks like so all the panels are there but it's just that they are in a different place so here is where you will choose your key here is the tempo settings here are all the tal names here is that mixer thing that was there on the phone and here is the style of tabla so if you see just the layout changes but you have all the functionalities just like you did on the phone so here Yeah, that's our tabla. Let me put that off. So yeah, that's our tanpura. This is our tabla. So this is how it sounds by default until you actually plug it into an external monitor. And I prefer that tabla richer sound on an external speaker. Okay. So that is it for today. I hope this was useful. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Thank you. Bye.